what's up everyone okay i'm gonna show you how to achieve the grand budapest hotel look why do you want to be a lobby boy who wouldn't at the grand budapest sir often referred to as the printed look when you're color grading this is a very unique look it's called the printed look because it looks like it's printed on film or if any of you have ever read through those more expensive sort of magazines fashion magazines a lot of the times they won't typically print it on magazine paper stock what they'll do is they'll print it on a matte paper and it's sort of thick it's it gives it a very unique interesting look anyway it's called the printed look and you can achieve that and it's something that wes anderson did in the final look and grade of the grand budapest hotel movie so let's recreate it this is a scene from china white what i'm going to do is i'm going to actually take my contrast node because if you think about it this is actually affecting our contrast and i'm going to create a second node here and i'm going to just call this node the um i'm going to call it shadows and i'll show you what we're going to be doing with that here in a moment but first with the contrast node what you're going to do is you're going to come over here to your curves and you're going to click these three dots right here and click add default anchors and you're going to just remove the middle anchors all right so all i have left are the two outside anchors and what i'm going to do is i'm going to bring my blacks up to right about here and i'm going to bring my whites to down right about there okay did you see what happened there with the image it's it's bringing up our highlights for sure but it's it's definitely making the final image look a little bit more matte okay so so far we've we've adjusted those highlights now let's go over here to our shadows you're going to go into the hdr wheels and you're going to adjust your shadows you're going to take this exposure down on the shadows and we're going to just bring those shadows down about there okay so that's how you create the printed look it's that simple so if i take these and i disable them you can see the original image and then you can see here with the final image with the printed look i can go over here to my contrast say that it's we're going a little too crazy with the highlights you can always bring that adjust that up and there it's not not so bam pow in your face all right so that's the printed look in davinci resolve basically recreating the budapest hotel